and do a little detailing on the gas door. Just again the usual stuff. Clean it up, especially the seams, because when you close that, you can you can still see what's down in there. And from an angle, you can see that. So I'm gonna go in there with some cleaner and some polishing compound, and we'll get that all cleaned up. Respray a little white if I need to. And then when we close it, it will you won't see this stuff down there. So let's give that a clean. So there's a little simple green and some scrubbing, and you can see everything coming loose. And just wipe things down, gets the heavy stuff off. Well, it looks like rubbing compound's not going to get that off, so I'm going to have to sand that a little bit, probably prime and paint it. And then for these little touch-up spots here, I got to use uh, some paint and some touch-up stick, and we'll get that cleaned up. Because when we close this, we want it to look really good right down there, right through here. We want that to look really good. So we'll uh, slow down here a little bit, do a little paint work, and we'll come back. I think that helps. Just. Whitens everything up. I'll probably put a little more right in here after this dries, but again, when we close it, the key is we don't want to see anything but white. So from what we started with, good little project. So we'll let that dry, put a touch more down at the bottom, then we'll see how she looks. There we go. That's looking pretty good. So let's go ahead and close that clean up there but now that again just the perimeter making that look good so when you glance at it from the side this is clean it's white it's bright and when you open it looks good these are some of the details that really help make a car pop when you look around the the bezel these are the backup lights there's a lot of crud in there and the chrome just needs to be perked up a little bit and the lens needs a polish so I'm gonna go through both these backup lights just clean everything up do a little polish on it and it should look a lot better when I'm done just used a little simple green and an old toothbrush took everything apart cleaned the lens inside and out cleaned the bezel got around all the grooves polished everything and Especially on a white car, just having all that crud out of there, lots of years of dirt and dust behind the lens, really makes a big difference. This one cleaned up pretty nice too. So we're just going to keep going around the car, piece at a time. <laughs> 